this is Jaime, and this is the first devlog for our 3D Metroidvania that my wife and I are working on. In this game, you play as a ray who goes around underwater through, a, through the ruins of an old city trying to figure out what happened. The game has a lot of emphasis on combat and platforming. Here is the character. He has very tight controls, and his attack feels very responsive. Right there you can see a dash. That's going to be one of the first abilities that you get in the game. We've been working on combat, some of the enemies, some of the fishes that dashes into you. That's a little bit of the combat right there. But, the game is more than likely not going to have any jumping in it. So, in order to make a lot of the platforming elements, we have incorporated these current this current mechanic. So basically, this little box right here, uh, it's one of the debug boxes. It just shows whenever you go into it, you get pushed into a certain direction. And this mechanic is going to be one of the big mechanics that is going to take place in a lot of scenes and creating a lot of the puzzles and a lot of the platforming throughout the whole game. We've done a lot of work on it and we have it in a pretty good state towards where we can move it wherever we want. Like so. And we also have a few variables here that we can change in order to change the speed of how fast you get pushed and how fast you get sucked into it. And as you might have seen, it also affects some of the enemies as well. So let's go ahead and try to see how this enemy reacts to it. Set him up right here. So, should hit him right here. Get started here. Cute little guy. There he goes. <laughs> One of our goals with this game is to always have very tight and fair feeling gameplay. We always want to make the player feel like if they lose, it's because of a mistake they made. We don't want the game to feel like it was unfair. So that's going to be one of our main focuses while trying to make this game. Here are a couple of the enemies we've been working on. We have a few more. but. Throughout the devlog series, we're going to be showcasing environments and, and art here and there, but we're going to try to keep a lot of the mechanics and enemies and areas, uh, we're, we're going to try to talk about them as little as possible so that you can go ahead and explore them whenever the game is actually finished. The style of the game, as you can see, is kind of got a little bit of a toony look which is what we're going for, where we think it's looking very, very nice so far. We're going to try to keep it very simple since we are a small team, but these levels are going to be monochromatic. They're going to be, they're going to have plenty of assets for world building and to just make it look nice. That is the end of our first devlog on our 3D Fishweightvania. If you have any comments, any questions or any suggestions, go ahead and leave them down below. Also check out the description for our other socials where we will also be posting updates on our game. Thanks for watching and have a great day.